Hello everybody out there in the video world, this is Dan with another movie review for you. This time it's uh, Cowboys and Aliens, starring Daniel Craig, Harrison Ford, and Olivia Wilde. Uh, this movie is rated PG-13 uh, for uh, western and sci-fi action sequences, uh, brief nudity, if you will, and uh, minor language. Um, I just came from the midnight show of this movie, and... I was let me, let me just say I was while I was pumped to see this movie I didn't know what to expect and I was um, highly disappointed. Um, the movie itself obviously uh, is about cowboys and aliens and the invasion of aliens and cowboys have to stop them. And by you can trade you can tell by the trailer that the cowboys have to go on this mission to rescue uh, people that have been kidnapped by the aliens for what purpose? Um, I don't think the movie does a really good job of telling you that for one thing um you follow daniel craig who has already been kidnapped by the aliens at one point and is dropped off in the middle of the desert you don't know why he doesn't know why and the whole movie is about him trying to discover what happened and what the aliens tried to do to him what they did to his uh, wife again you can see that in the trailer um and i i just the movie just the, the first 20 minutes especially just drug on forever and ever, and you just wanted it to stop. And, and then Olivia Wilde comes in the picture, and obviously everything's better with her in there. And um, But it, it just continues to, to just drag on a, until the last, say, 20 minutes of the movie where the action really begins. And um, the, the visual effects on the aliens are actually pretty good. Uh, the ships they fly, um, obviously, you know, they're alien technology, so you don't know what to expect. Um, the movie itself is based off the uh, graphic novel Cowboys and Aliens, uh, but it just it didn't. I wasn't impressed. Um, Harrison Ford and Daniel Craig, obviously, really well, good actors, um, and they did a good job. But they they didn't have a great story to work with. I, I just don't think it was there. Um, Olivia Wilde obviously played her role beautifully. Um, she actually has a surprise in this movie that you can't tell by the trailer, so I'm not going to give it away. Um, and, you know, some supporting actors uh, did their part. You know, I, I just, again, it just didn't do it for me. The, the story just wasn't there. It couldn't keep my attention. Even with the visual effects and the action and the main action sequence at the end, it just wasn't there for me. So I, I really hate to do this. Um, a little disappointed I'm, I'm doing this, but I've got to half thumbs up. Just a half thumbs up. So I'm not recommending this movie. Um, I wouldn't recommend it to anybody. I'm just letting you know. Um, I was going to do a dedication, but I don't think uh, the person I want to dedicate to would appreciate me dedicating a movie that's only a half thumb up. So I I'll have to do that dedication next time. Anyway, um, go to the movies. Let me know what you see. Let me know what you think. And uh, we'll see you next time at the movies.